Well, Islam Makhachev, it's great to see you again. Thanks so much for your time on Fox Sports Australia. Good to see you. Now, things changed very, very quickly. This card would, was locked in by the UFC for a very long time, but in the space of a couple of days, it was turned on its head. What was your reaction when you heard that it was no longer to be a rematch against Charles Oliveira, but now a rematch against Alex Volkanovsky? Uh, when they announced the fight, I was very happy because really? I really want to beat Volkanovsky again. They can give me anyone like Gamrod, we have some, some other guys. But when they say Volkanovski is going to be ag again, I was very happy. Why were you so happy? Because after first fight, we have many questions. People talking about this fight. And uh, I want to beat him again. I want to finish him. How do you want to answer those questions this time around? I just want to show my level, you know. Uh, in the Australia, I beat him, unanimous decision, but last round he won, he looking great in the last round, but this time I want to look for the finish because I have to show people how, I, how good I am. Well, the last time we spoke, you described Alex Volkanovsky as the toughest opponent that you've ever encountered. Why is that? Because this guy is tough, you know. He never give up. Mm. He fight all five rounds. And, you know, if you want to beat him or finish him, just you have to make him sleep, you know. Yeah. But other, thi other way, he, he will fight five rounds. What are you expecting Alex Volkanovsky to do differently in this fight? I don't think he change some plan or do something, uh, some other, but he improved a lot from the first fight, I know. He training, he trained his wrestling skills, grappling skills before the fight, and he improved a lot. That's why we see how he beat Yair, he take him down and smash him in the ground. Were you impressed by his form performance against Yair Rodriguez? No, I just thinking he's, he will beat him, but not like that easy. Okay. You thought it was an easy performance, an easy win for Volk? No, I think so. Okay. Uh, I, might, uh, I might flip the question then, Islam. Do you need to change anything to ensure that you get the win this time around? No, I don't have to change. I just have to cut weight, recovery, mm -hmm. and step to the cage. You haven't fought since that fight in February. Are you worried that the inactivity might work against you? Who? Oh. Y the fact that Alex fought Yair, but you haven't uh -huh. fought in, in since February. Are you worried about that? No. Just when you say give me, I'm ready. Will Habib be in your corner this time around? No, he's not. He's not in my corner, but all training camps, he helped me a lot. Mm. The last fight you predicted would end very early. You said you'd finish him within three rounds. What's your prediction for this fight? No, I don't know which round, where, but mm -hmm. I will looking for the finish and it's going to be a huge fight for the fans. We will fight and he have good skills, I have good skills. This is going to be a very good fight for the old fans. Do you think this is Alex Volkanovsky's last chance at 155 pounds if he loses to you? Do you think that people might dismiss him as, dismiss him rather as a genuine threat at lightweight? Mm, yeah, I think he's, uh, this is uh, his last chance. This is uh, his last dance in 155. Wow. As well with um, with the way that he fought as well, are, y are you disappointed with the way that his team has carried on after the fight, you know, with the, all the accusations and, and whatnot? Yeah, can you repeat about it? Are you, are you disappointed with the mm. way that his team carried on after the fight? Is there a bit of bad blood here now? With uh, what what he was able, what he was saying with the IV. Uh -huh, uh -huh, yeah, okay. yeah, 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 yeah. They make some drama, but you know, they like. I understand if somebody else say, but the, his team say all these things. Like all these guys, fighters, we know the how Usada check us all the time, mm. and they make some drama after the fight. Usada call me and give me many questions, but I told Osada, hey guys, 
where I live in the hotel, you have camera everywhere, in the lobby, first floor, elevator, like close to my room, mm -hmm. you can check and uh, you can check what they say, some, someone come to my room, make IV for me, you can check and told the old people. But after when I s say this to Yusada, all this finish, you know, because I'm a professional fighter. I'm a UFC champion. I never did some. I never touched some things, you know. That's why I'm for the clear sport, and I follow this all my life. Well, Islam, it's one of the the biggest rivalries in the sport at the moment. We can't wait to see you in action once again. Thanks so much for your time. Thank you, man. Cheers.